guys welcome to yet another trade recap whereby i'll be showing you like euro jpy and news jpy setups that i shared with you like on the 18th of december and then if you haven't watched those analysis you can just use the link in the description below and don't forget to subscribe and click that notification bell and share the video if you're taking video from this channel guys so the first trade is euro jpy here so on euro jpy i was uh, i given a signal here for a sell in my vip group whereby i was anticipating for us to take the sell at this point here and our stop loss was just above this point here and then our overall take profit was around this point here even though like i don't have like the bar replay but you'll get to see like a screenshot i'll just put a screenshot so that you can see it and then uh, my anticipation was for us to reach the 90 percent rule as we broke structure at this point here so the break of this uh structure was very corrective i was just taking a trade that is valid in this point here it was not a high probability setup but a valid setup guys so as you can see here price action decided to push to the upside in this type of format and then what it did what i did was that i moved to the 15 minute as I saw that our price action was pushing a little bit to the upside creating an ascending channel and then I told my people that just remove the trade and then we'll get another setup of which I was anticipating a mini double top within here on the 15 minute and then the first tight flag that's where we were going to take uh, that sell below structure and then our stop loss would be just above this point just because um, our reward was very nice guys there was no need for us to get like a tight stop just because from here to there it was 6.5 percent of which it was still okay for us to take so what price did was that it decided to push to the upside let me just remove a few things here and then just show you so price action decided to push to the upside that's when i didn't evolve and then i wasn't on the charts just because i knew that there were euro there were uh, jpy news that were coming up so that's why you get like this uh, impulsive move to the downside as i always say guys news follow structure news follow structure they just create volatility guys just know that news follow structure and they create volatility nothing else they don't anticipate that direction they just give you that volatility that is needed in the market so if you are in the right side of the market then you can uh bank a lot of profits so what i'm thinking on the 15 minute what i'm thinking on the 15 minute what i could have done guys just because uh what you have to do is always try to go back to those old trades that you took and then just see if you could have done something different so what i could have done was this here as you can see here a mini ascending channel within there and then we have a one two and then three and then the three was in line with the double top but we didn't get the double top and then i was anticipating the double top on euro on usdgpy but you'll get to see that also a sell at that point would have been nice and then our stop loss should have been like just above this point here for about maybe let's just say um uh 48 pips would be fine and then your stop loss your first take profit is around here for 3.5 and the overall take profit would have been around uh, plus minus 10 percent guys on this one trade so um could have done things different or i could have waited for this in this area here but i don't like trading news that much i'm not good at trading news guys i just follow the structure as you can see here and on the daily chart let me just explain the daily chart for you guys so on the daily we have this uh, current market structure here as you can see here we have this structure this nice ascending channel within here and we had like this uh, double top at that point that was broken in this area here as i was saying in the previous video so let's look at usd jpy this is a quick recap and then guys the 500 special of which it's 28 dollars in dollars it's still on guys up until further notice so this one also was shared in this group we had an ascending and then a pattern extension at this point here and then moving to the four hour that's where we check for momentum and then i like that i like i like uh, I, I would like to do these things uh, quite more so that you can get to understand each and everything even if you join my vip group you can just get to understand come in come in the group knowing something uh 
and then most of the people who join the group know that they get something from this uh, VIP this uh, telegram this uh, YouTube and then they can get to uh, speed up the, the, the process of learning guys speed up the process of learning so as you can see previously I was saying that this is an impulse corrective move impulse larger corrective move whereby we will get like the third touch or the double top override and then we look for those nice cells guys so on the hour chat let me just show you the hour chat so on the hour guys this was a nice setup guys I, sh I don't know how I missed this one but I don't blame myself I don't blame anyone I'm going to get like a uh, good trades this year before the year ends or oh, next year guys doesn't matter the market will just do it for me I'm not going to rush anything and then this was the setup that I was waiting for guys I'll share a a screenshot also for the setup share it in my group showed them we are going to sell in this point showed everyone in the youtube space that we are going to sell in this point here just because this is a corrective price action for us to push to the downside and then we had another corrective move here and then what i was thinking was that it will just correct up until that override and then we look for that sell and then our stop loss is just above this point here so uh, let's just see uh, on this one so on this mistrade guys it was exactly 10% guys it was exactly 10% 10% no lie guys so we missed about 20% uh, on two trades guys and then remember I shared these setups on the 18th and then today as I'm recording this video it's uh, the 21st guys 20, 21st of December so uh, we missed good setups we missed good setups but like uh, it doesn't matter doesn't matter guys we will get like nice trades uh, you all know you all know guys you all know so uh, i'll see you on another video please do subscribe do click the notification bell do share the video do comment on a takeaway that you took on this video and then guys if you want to join the vip group it's still 500 over just 28 dollars and these recaps will be made each and every day each and every setup that i share with you guys i'll show you the results and what i have to do now is show you the trades that i took even if it's blue even if it's red show you the setups show you the take profits and show you everything just be uh, transparent with, with each and every one of you guys so that you can see uh, how things are going with trading guys it's not all um, nice things with trading so this is the tight flag but i don't like tight flags like this as you all know i like a flat flag guys so this is not a tight flag that i would take i like a flat flag a push to the downside and then the tight flag should be flat to two bottoms and two tops and then that is where you get this type of movement and then you look for that cell so on this one i don't like it if it was like at the top of the structure it, it would have been nice just because i know that we have the override and then we are protected with this stop loss at the top of the structure and then we look for the sell guys so yeah i'll see you on another market breakdown or another trade recap just because as i said i'll be doing these type of things each and every day each and every setup that i share share with you guys and then i'll put something on the corner maybe a uh, screen record of my phone when i take a trade when the trade is in wins when the trade is in losses so that you can just feel the transparency guys of trading